Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video guys to any of you having a Hyundai vehicle and you want to remove or replace a BS sensor, also known as speed or wheel sensor guys. Stay with us, we will explain where it's located, how to remove it, what you need to know guys, because if you do something wrong, okay, it could be a really headache removing that sensor. You can break it and uh, you may even need to remove the, uh, the CV axle or the hub to actually fix that. So we will explain what not to do and what to avoid so make sure to stay until the end even though we will be demonstrating on Hyundai Sonata the video may be helpful on multiple Hyundai models such as Hyundai Sonata, Elantra, Accent, Veloster, Tucson and Santa Fe as well. If you guys need to buy any parts, tools, anything for your Hyundai guys, okay, we're going to share the links in the description of the video below for your convenience and you can see where we get all the tools and parts from for a really good price and quick shipping as well. Another thing, every single car we get at the garage, we try to make at least two to 300 free repair videos. Why we do that? Simply because our mission at the shop is to save you as much money as we can guys. All we need in return, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, that way we can save you even more money and provide even more videos. Now, if you have a Hyundai, you want to check guys our second channel it's called electrical car repair life we are going to share so much helpful information about diagnostics engine codes and things like that there as well so definitely check it out so specifically we will demonstrate on the 2013 Hyundai what we have guys we have the car in year we have the uh, front right tire out because that's uh, the sensor that we need to remove on the front right it doesn't work if you want to see how to test speed sensor and how to find out which uh, speed sensor is better we have a special video that's going to teach you that now with the wheel okay you just have to remove it pretty simple jack your vehicle up support it with the jack stand remove the wheel get a penetrating spray and uh, right here guys this is your speed sensor uh, on top not where the body is where the wire is you want to spray okay and let it soak spray multiple times because you have quite a bit of dust there okay break dust all kind of stuff stuck there that will make it really really hard to come out and if you break it you may need to remove the hub or the cv axle to push the broken piece out now uh, with all that being said guys first Let's explain. You need to follow your ABS wire, the ABS sensor wire. It goes all the way to there and it goes under the okay, under the fender liner. So you may need to release your fender liner. And right there it's our clip. In some cases, ours it's supposed to hang up there on a the clip. It's broken. Just press in the middle, release it. Okay. Once you follow the clip and you release it, guys, okay, you will need to uh, remove all the bolts that hold up uh, that cable or that wire to the body or to the strut itself. You may have multiples, okay? In our case, we'll have three. One here, one on the back side that we pre-loosen. And then we'll have one more which is located, okay, towards there. Perfect. We're removing that one. You can see the wiring harness comes out. It's very important to install it exactly in reverse order that we take it apart. Here we have one clip, that uh, this clip, how you remove it. Okay, if you have a clip like that, you can see the two things we need to squish together. Okay, and pull it out at the same time. Try not to break it, perfect. We can remove the 10 millimeter bolt on the speed sensor now. Okay, right there. And we'll show you how it's gonna come out. That thing may be stuck really bad. If you uh, use penetrating spray, your wife may be much easier, guys. You get a screwdriver and gently don't pry too hard because you can break it. Go on this side and go on the side a little bit. Okay. And oh, ours came loose. And check it out now. If you see, the penetrating spray made it all the way inside. Okay, you can see where it's wet, so that's why it's not stuck, otherwise you have quite a bit of contamination. That's where it's reading, okay, on the CV axle, the position of the CV axle, so it can tell, okay, the speed of that wheel as well. So that's how you remove it. If you need to buy one, or you want to see how to test one, guys, we'll have the videos on the channel, how to test the ABS speed sensor on Hyundai, please check it out. Also, if you need to buy one for a good price, we'll put the link in the description of the video below, and putting it together is in reverse order. We took it apart. Thank you for watching and see you guys next time.